In this movie, we will show a range of network scanning implementations using Kofax Express and Autobytes. We will show how a simple push on a button can trigger a complete capture process. Before we get to the demonstrations, this is how it works. Most networked scan devices have an ability to scan to folder. Autobytes picks up the images from the folders and sends them to the correct Kofax Express job. Documents are then delivered to a document management system of choice. Practically, you define push buttons on the panel of your network scanner device. Most devices come with a browser-based tool to define those buttons. For each document process, you just need to push the correct button and feed the documents through. They are then transmitted to the correct folder. Then Autobytes takes over and depending on the folder, sends each document to the correct job for automatic processing and export. The functionality of this setup is impressive. Kofax Express can process all incoming files with VRS. Other functions are automatic document separation, barcode reading, database lookup, super color compression and conversion to searchable PDF. Through standard and optional Capture Bytes connectors, the resulting documents can be exported to a wide variety of backend systems, including multiple destinations. Optional functions are available such as splitting long documents, digitally imprinting images and generating bookmarked and secure PDF files. Next, we'll show the system in action with some practical demonstrations. We have defined four push buttons on our network scanner. Each button scans to a folder linked to a capture process. The business cards will be converted to searchable PDF format. The invoices will trigger a database lookup. The registered mail will be loaded into an SQL tracking database and service reports will be emailed to support administration. Let's start with the business cards job. We just visited some customers in Antwerp and want to scan their business cards. As soon as Autobytes detects images in the business cards folder, it starts processing them. Notice how they are correctly oriented and any blank sites removed. Next, they are exported as searchable PDF to my Evernote account. In Evernote, I can search now on any word on the business cards thanks to the searchable text layer. Now we have some incoming invoices to scan. Pushing the Invoices button sends all scanned invoices to the Invoices job folder and triggers a different process. This time we read a barcode label from each invoice to separate them and look up the supplier information. We also enhance the images with VRS to improve the readability of faded text. Images are converted to searchable PDF and sent to a file server. Now we can use the standard search capabilities in Windows 7 to search on any word in the invoices. For example, searching for 2006 lists all invoices with that number somewhere in the text. Our third demo is about tracking outgoing registered mail in a database. Just push the registered mail button and scan the mail. Kofax Express detects the new images, automatically wakes up, processes the mail with the correct job and exports to an SQL database. Through a browser, we can now easily search any outgoing registered mail piece, check the status and view the original mail directly in the browser. And finally, we have some service reports to scan. In this job, we'll send an email with the signed service report to the customer and CC our accounting department. To accomplish this, we make use of the Capture Bytes email export connector. And emails already arrived. This is the inbox of our accountant receiving copies of all the emails with the service reports attached ready for invoicing. During this movie we made use of a network scanner for our demonstrations. But any network device like a digital copier or smartphone with a document capture app that can send images to a folder can be used. If it can scan to a folder it can automatically start a capture process. For detailed information and a trial download, visit CaptureBytes.com.